the British royal family has sparked considerable concern among their fans in recent months. With Charles's and Catherine's simultaneous health scares, the monarchy appears weaker than ever. But the question that worries people the most is... Where is Kate Middleton? The rumours surrounding the Princess of Wales are wild. From reports of failed plastic surgery to speculations about Prince William possibly cheating, and her recent picture has sparked theories that the real Kate might not even be in Britain anymore. The photograph staged. Is it really her? Is it fake? So what's really happening? Let's delve deeper and uncover the truth. People are genuinely concerned about Britain's beloved royal, and they're not mincing words. On January 17th, out of the blue, the palace announces that Kate had undergone planned abdominal surgery. But many weren't buying it. Their main gripe? If it was truly scheduled, what prompted her to suddenly change her plans? Didn't Catherine have events on her calendar that had to be cancelled because of her health? But planned surgery just means it wasn't an emergency. Abdominal surgery alone cannot justify a complete communication blackout. Another puzzling aspect was the report stating that Kate would need to recover for almost two weeks. What kind of surgery did she have that required such a lengthy hospital stay? Well, it's very unusual to stay in hospital for 14 days if at home you've got the comfort that you could have with someone coming in and looking after yeah. you. And why is she still keeping away from the public eye? Nobody spotted Kate leaving the hospital and heading back to Windsor Home Park for her further recuperation. She hasn't shared any recovery updates on Instagram either. All her fans got was a brief official statement from her representatives. She hopes that the public will understand her desire to maintain as much normality for her children as possible, and her wish that her personal medical information remains private. Also, around the same time, King Charles was undergoing treatment for an enlarged prostate. He was later diagnosed with cancer, which he openly talked about. He made a few public appearances, thanked everyone for their support, and the palace even put out a new photo of him. So why isn't Kate doing the same? People are used to seeing her looking good and always around, no matter what's happening. So there's been a ton of talk about why she's been hiding away. You're telling me that Kate Middleton, the same woman who posed outside the hospital like a freaking supermodel mere hours after giving birth, suddenly requires months of recovery before showing her face, and the British press now magically respects privacy? This feels sinister. She was relentless. And that unwavering consistency is key to Kate's public image. Now, Catherine was oddly absent for weeks before the surgery. Even her birthday in January seemed to slip under the radar. She spent the day at her parents' place to treat herself. But was William there with her? Is everything OK between them? Well, there's been talk about their relationship problems for a while now. People are looking closely at photos where the couple seems distant and they've been seen going to events on their own quite a lot. What's more, the old rumours about William's affair have resurfaced. Remember Catherine's Norfolk neighbour, Rose Hanbury, whose alleged connection with the prince made headlines? That may be another reason why the princess has been keeping a low profile, and the palace is trying to figure out how to deal with it all. On the other hand, people were expecting William to say something about his wife's condition, but he's been keeping quiet with journalists. He only made one comment about both Kate and his dad together. I'd like to take this opportunity to say thank you also for the kind messages of support for Catherine and for my father, especially in recent days. It means a great deal to us all. Then Prince's spokesperson mentioned, his focus is on his work and not on social media. However, there's an interesting detail. William cancelled his plans to attend his godfather's memorial service for personal reasons. What those reasons are, nobody specified again. And now, another surprising theory has emerged. There's speculation that Kate Middleton's mental health might also be a concern, especially considering her past struggles during pregnancy. This idea was put forward by Angela Levin, a biographer of Queen Camilla. She thinks that's why William is cancelling engagements and spending more time at home. He's a mature man and he will know that his priority is to look after his wife, who has been so wonderfully supportive to him. But wait, there's more. 
Spanish TV host Concha Calleja has gone so far as to suggest that the princess has been put into a coma. Supposedly, she was dealing with complications from a mysterious surgery, according to an anonymous source within the royal household. The doctors had to take drastic decisions at that moment because of the complications that arose. The decision was to put her in an induced coma. They had to intubate her. The situation got so out of hand that the palace had to step in and address all these rumors, calling them complete nonsense. It's fundamentally totally made up. And I'll use polite English here. It's absolutely not the case. As you can imagine, people were coming up with all sorts of insane ideas. From what I understand, William is drunk and passed out, and now she's in a coma. She underwent plastic surgery, and now she's locked in a tower because she won't sign divorce papers. I guess I missed a lot, but that's my theory. And just as the internet was going wild, Catherine was spotted by photographers. The Princess of Wales was seen in a car wearing glasses with her mom, Carol Middleton, at the wheel. It seems like a relief, doesn't it? But even then, fans had their doubts. Some couldn't believe it was their beloved princess in the photo. They started comparing her cheekbones before and after, and some even suggested it might be her look-alike. My current theory is that they found a reasonable body double who is now recovering from extensive plastic surgery to make her an exact doppelganger, but it's not going as they hoped. Royal expert Amanda Matter, who discusses palace gossip on TikTok, has bluntly stated, it's all just for show. The car paparazzi shot is Kate Middleton's go-to move when she wants to be seen but not answer any questions. Breaking it down, Amanda points out a few times in the past when Kate showed herself in a car following fans' concerns, such as after Harry's book criticized her. So this recent photo is just a way to give the public what they want without getting too deep into it. The point of this photo is to tell us that she is alive and to get the craziest of the crazy conspiracy theories to stop. After that, the Kensington Palace finally shared an official photo of Kate with her kids, wishing everyone a happy Mother's Day. The claim was that Prince William himself took the picture. It was supposed to put an end to the rumors, but it's only fueled them even more. Just look at the clues, no wedding or engagement rings, and a green tree in the background in cold March. This photo looks doctored. Catherine's right hand around Lewis is entirely blurry, and Lewis' middle finger must be awfully long to be entirely wrapped around the next finger. There were numerous instances of such fakery. Charlotte's cardigan is missing a sleeve, there's a zipper on Catherine's jacket, and there's something off about the pattern in her hair. Multiple global news agencies recalled the image just hours later, because, in fact, the charming postcard wasn't genuine, but rather created using artificial intelligence or Photoshop. Why not just go for a real photo? Fans asked. Catherine felt the need to explain herself in a post on Kensington Palace's official social media account. Like many amateur photographers, I do occasionally experiment with editing. I wanted to express my apologies for any confusion the family photograph we shared yesterday caused. Naturally, trust took another hit. Well, these theories, wild as they may seem, stem from a real issue. Kate has been the go-to face for the British family, always there with a smile at every public event. And then, out of the blue, she vanished. According to official info, she won't be making an appearance until Easter at the earliest. Sure, maybe she needs a break and her health is the real reason. Or perhaps she just wants to be with her kids. But wouldn't you like to hear something from her directly? What do you think about Catherine's silence? Share your thoughts under this video and stay awesome.